All right, come on in, hit the like button, think about subscribing if you're already. You're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is my personal opinion review for the 2024 Netflix action film called The Shadow Straits. Now here's the plot. 11-year-old assassin is suspended due to a sloppy mission in Japan. She meets 11-year-old Manji who loses his mother and sets out to rescue him. Now here's the cast. Honestly, this was such a non-stop, badass, very brutal film. I flat out loved the constant fight scenes with the martial arts knife and sword fighting and even the gun fighting. Um, the camera movements with the movements of the two actresses and the villain during each fight scene and dramatic scenes added to the intensity of each scene, along with the score. I also loved the lighting they chose for all the uh, night shots. Night scenes, uh, the two actresses did such a fantastic job with their role, especially the main one, which they had more of, but was also very super badass characters. I love the modern day ninja feel to parts of the story, while mostly everything else felt very John Wick inspired. And uh, it definitely has uh, a gets somewhat over the top with the the gore and the, the splatter, but it doesn't go home off like the kind of Torotino type of, of splatter, you know? Um, but it definitely has its kind of unrealisticness to it, but it's it's really good. Uh, but here's my rating, I'll come back with my font thoughts. This was such an intense, violent gore fest of a film. That alone, I really want a sequel, and it kind of looks like we're going to get one, but I haven't heard anything yet, because I think this came out today or last week. I think it came out like last week or the week before, actually, now I think of it. Uh, so they haven't really had time to uh, see if they're going to make a, uh, announce a sequel yet, but maybe they already have already. Sometimes they do that. Um, but also because they barely gave the backstory to the Assassin Shadow Organization. Um, they mostly focus way more on, on this female's journey. Um, but man, was this a fun, awesome, badass film that had me go on nonstop. Uh, I highly recommend it. Um, I can't really say much more about that because, again, I highly recommend it. I want you to go in with not as much information but um you know other than i told you and um just this this really have a fun time with this film it was really, really good but as always leave your comments down below hopefully i have something out sunday i don't know if i'm going to be putting out anything in general um it's probably something from 2009 um if you saw my post about it but uh, who knows who knows uh, but in the meantime remember i love you all please stay safe spread the love most poorly Skull.